three more Senate Republicans have called on GOP Senate candidate Roy Moore to drop out his special election race in Alabama as he faces a series of UAL misconduct allegations. I think ITD be best if he stepped aside, Sen. Rob Portman, Ohio, said in an interview on NBC's Meet the Press on Sunday. Sen. Tim Scott, or South Carolina, said on ABC's This Week the best thing Roy Moore could do for the country is move on. And Sen. John Thune, our South Dakota, a member of GOP leadership, said on Fox News Sunday, it's going to be a distraction for us and for our agenda. The president began his Sunday blasting Democratic Alabama Senate candidate Doug Jones and again indicating his support on Twitter for more. The last thing we need in Alabama and the U.S. Senate is a Schumer-Pelosi puppet who is weak on crime, weak on the border, bad for our military and our great vets bad for our Second Amendment, and wants to raise his taxes to the sky. Jones would be a disaster, he tweeted. He also reminded America that he did not support more during the primary. I endorsed Luther Strange in the Alabama primary. He shot way up in the polls but at WASNT enough. Can't let Schumer Pelosi win this race. Liberal Jones would be bad arriving back at the White House Sunday evening. Mr. Trump ignored shouted questions about whether head campaign for more. Jones spokesman Sebastian Kitchen responded in a statement to CBS News. Doug Jones is continuing to focus on finding common ground and getting things done for real Alabamians. His record as a prosecutor speaks for itself. Roy Moore was unfit for office before nine Alabama women served as witnesses to all Alabamians of his disturbing conduct. CBS News' Steve Jaggeris contributed to this report.